Hey guys, welcome back to the Pokemon Shield Nuzlocke. Let's get going. Let us get green. So, yeah, I know I missed Saturday, and I'm sorry about that. I really am. But, yeah. Alright, so, uh, in the last video, we were here. Uh, we took on Beatty, and Beatty actually knocked out a couple of our team members. Uh, Patrick, the Slowbro, and Cologne, the Aromatis. So we went ahead and replaced those two with uh, Carly and Nightfox. Alright, <laughs> I was just checking to make sure everything's like going through right. So, um, yeah, we placed them with those two, so now we're going to go ahead and, um, and, uh, do the next thing, which is taking on the gym leaders. That's what we were supposed to start before, but then Beatty showed up and it was all Beatty-ish. So let's, t let's take a look at the bracket here. Or will it not let me look at the bracket? Okay, I guess it won't let me look at the bracket. Alright, so, uh, we're going to take on Nessa, and I know that just because I've played this game before. So I have Carl up front, which is who I am going to have up front for this. So, uh, yeah, let's get going. Hopefully I'll be able to finish this, like, soon. I figure I have this video. I figure I have... Two more videos after this. I can tell you've grown far stronger since you faced me in Holbury Stadium. I've had to hand it to our undefeated champion. He's got a proper eye for talent, too. But you're not the champion, and you'll never become the champion either. Do you know why? It's because I, Nessa, am going to defeat both you and Leon. I'm not going to underestimate you again. I'll use Dynamax to wash you out to sea and beyond the horizon. Wait, Dynamax? Hold on. Oh, okay, that's fine. Here we go, taking on Nessa. Let's do it. Golisopod. I don't like how bright that is. Okay, well that's better. I guess that's all I had to say. Sonya might be disappointed, but I'm... Wait, what? Ooh. Okay. Let us... Let's iron defense it up. Ah, uh, yes. The iron barbs. Okay, let us use Power Whip. That'll be neutral. It's going to use Sword Stance. Okay, so hopefully this Power Whip will get it down to half and force it out. Okay, that should force it out, right? Yeah, that forced it out. Who is coming in next? Seeking. Power Whip. Alright, Sea King's gonna use Aqua Ring so it'll heal itself by just a little bit each each uh, after each turn. Oh, really? It avoided it? Let's try it again. Mega Horn? Haha, <laughs> we avoided it. What? Everyone be avoiding everyone. Alright, that's right. I raised my defense. Yes, the Iron Barbs. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. There we go, finally, after three attempts, it finally hits the Sea King. Okay. That's good. Golisopod is next. I will switch, actually. Uh, bug type, so we'll go with... Uh, um, scooper. We'll get... Uh, We'll give Carl a break there. It says. Uh, 
Okay, now, I don't think Elisapod was that fast. Okay, the Hurricane hit's awesome. That's the only thing about Hurricane, it's not that accurate a move, so, so you gotta be careful with that sometimes. But it hits, so that works out well for me. Barrascuta. Ooh, Barrascuta! We'll switch. We haven't used Carly yet, we're gonna use Carly. Hopefully Barrascuta doesn't come at me with like a crunch or something. You know what, this is probably a bad idea, looking back. Looking, looking back on my decision from seven seconds ago, this was probably not the best idea. Okay, maybe I can outspeed it, but uh, if that thing comes at me with like a crunch or something, that would suck. Throat chop. That's a fighting type move. It's super. Wait, what? Is throat chop a fighting type move? Why is that super effective? Ooh, it's paralyzed. That was lucky. <laughs> That was lucky AF. Jesus is a four star. All right, come on, let's get a crit. Let's get a crit. Okay. All right, so throat chop. I'm a psychic type. Carly's a pure psychic type. So if, if throat chop had to be either bug or dark, right? I know it's not ghost. Throat chop. It's got to be. I guess it's a dark type move, huh? Um, let's see, that thing is faster than Carly, though. I think Carly's my fastest Pokemon. Let me look at something here. Yeah, 126 speed, 110. Yeah, definitely my fastest Pokemon. So if that thing outsped Carly, it's going to outspeed everything. So, Throat Chop. I think Carl's going to be it. Let's see here. I am going to... Oh my god. I need to get more potions. I'm going to max potion Carl. Alright, it goes for throat chop again. So it'll knock itself out. Yeah, that was definitely the right play. What's next? What is next? Pelipper. I will switch to Carly. Alright, so yeah, Carly will definitely outspeed Pelipper. Carly with that Thunderbolt, though. I'm lucky that Carly didn't... didn't um, well, I don't know if I'm lucky, but I'm glad that Carly didn't faint to that throat chop. Pelipper's using Drizzle. Okay. So, if Pelipper hits me with something, I'm pretty much done, skis. We're gonna Thunderbolt. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, Dreadnought. We'll switch. We will switch to Carl. Looks like I'm down to one last Pokemon. I've been saving the best for last! Oh, Gorsh. She's, she's got the Dreadnought, guys. Alright, so you know she's gonna Gigantamax that thing, so we're gonna max Overgrowth. Um, or should we max Guard first to see what it does? I think I'm gonna do that. I think I'm gonna max Guard first and see what it tries to do to me. Watch, it uses like flamethrower or something. Now, any fire type, because that's really my biggest weakness is fire. Um, so, I mean, any fire type moves will be weakened due to the water. But the fact that I'm, all, I'm already four times weak to that, I don't know. I, I don't think Dreadnought would have any fire type moves. But we'll see. We'll see what it, what it comes at me with. If it comes at me with water or rock or even like a crunch, I'm, I feel pretty good about being able to... To knock it out.
Alright, we got the max guard up. Okay, max darkness. Okay. Okay. I can dig it. Max overgrowth. Yeah. Special defense fell. <laughs> I love it. Grass grew to cover the battlefield, but that's okay because Dreadnought just exploded. Or fainted. Technically it fainted, but it looked like it exploded. Alright. That was pretty cool. Carl, you are the MVP of this battle. Yep, you're not going to be the champ, Nessa. Too bad. So freaking sad. Yep, I've defeated you twice now, and you've defeated me zero times. We are too much. Even with my Dynamax partner, you weathered our waves and stood firm. Now that I think about it, Sonya was saying something about how amazing you were. I wish I'd pay more attention to what she was talking about. I bet everyone in Gallers got their eyes on you now. You defeated my team, and now you've got to ride that current all the way to the end. Now, don't go anywhere, ladies and gentlemen. The second battle of the first round will begin shortly. Oh, here we go. Okay, yeah, so we are going to take on Alistair. Ooh, I'm nervous about this Alistair battle, guys. I am freaking nervous AF. Let's see what we can do. Let's see what we can do. All right, so first of all, I need to get some, I need to get some potions because, yeah, I'm going <laughs> to... I am going to be using those potions, I know, a lot. I have plenty of full restores. But I don't want to use those forest stores if I don't have to. So we'll, you know, we'll use the potions. So that battle went well. Uh, you there. Yes, I'm here to buy. Let's get some hyper potions. Uh, 20 of those. Yeah, 20 will be good. Mm -hmm. And then max potion. Um, I have three. Let's get six. 17 of those. Yeah. And the forest store, I have 16. Let's just get four. Mm hmm. Okay. Let's see here. Let me sell some of my revives. I haven't sold, I've collected these revives during this, this uh, deal. Let me go ahead and sell five. Uh, I'm going to keep the max revives just because, because, the reason I'm going to keep them is just because mm, they're hard to find, and when I finish, or if I'm able to finish the Nuzlocke, that's another thing, if I white out, or like if I get down to the point where I only have like one team member left, I'm probably just going to stop right there, um, but um, if I do end up actually completing the Nuzlocke, um, you know, I may do the after game, but I'm going to play the after game as, like, just regular. I'm not going to nuzlocke the after game. So, that's why I'm keeping the max revives, just because those are difficult to find. And I would like to, if I do end up playing the post game on here, I would like to, like, have those. So, that's why I'm, I'm holding on to them for now. Everyone's waving at me. Alright, so, I know... Alistair ends with his Gengar. I'm trying to remember what he begins with, though. Let's see. Now, Pokemon. Now, Machamp. We're going to check the summary here. I'm probably going to start with Night Fox. Let's see here. Machamp. Okay. Dual Chop Earthquake. That's a good one, actually. Um, Surf, Rain Dance, Hurricane, Ice Beam, Crunch. Ooh, that might not be bad either. Crunch. Fire Lash, X Scissor, Coil, Light Screen, Fake Out, Thunderbolt, Psychic. Light Screen is good. I mean, I feel like this is the one that I need to go into, right? Or that I need to, like, like battle with? I mean, it has all dark type moves. And I know what you guys are thinking. Why wouldn't you give this thing any type coverage? It really can't learn that many, like, that many moves, or that many good moves, I should say. So, like, I don't know, this is, this is the, the moveset that I kind of stuck with, so it's, it's the one that I'm going to, like, end up using. 
I think we will start out with Night Fox because it is fairly fast and I might be able to outspeed something or at least get a parting shot in. So we're going to go ahead and swap Night Fox to the front. And let's go ahead. I'm going to save actually. And then we'll go ahead and take on our next uh, our next person. Ladies and gentlemen, we're already at the second match of the finals. Of the four remaining challengers, which two will be left for the last match? If you're just tuning in, ladies and gentlemen, we witnessed quite the surprise during the finals here at this year's Champion Cup as the former gym challenger, Beatty, stormed the stage, but Mateo was having none of it. This year's top challenger made quick work of him before washing away gym leader Nessa. And now to take her on, here comes gym leader Alistair, the boy known far and wide as the silent school-age star. I'm Alistair, you look well. I remember you. You were the strongest gym challenger I had, or so I reckon. We, we sh should battle. <laughs> I, <laughs> I, I'm having way too much fun. I think it's because I know I'm getting toward the end. You are challenged by gym leader Alistair. Gym leader Alistair sent out Dusk Noir. This freaking thing. Okay. But this thing is very slow, so... Oh, freaking goodness. All right. Okay, let's look at these moves. So we've got that one, which sharply raises a special attack. This one lets me go first, as long as he's attacking. Lowers the target's attack and special attack, then switches. That might be a good one, actually. And then Dark Pulse. Let's see, let me use Nasty Plot. We're gonna use Nasty Plot and see if we can raise our raise our special attack here. Because I remember Dusknar being more of a... Okay, he uses Rock Tomb. I was gonna say, I remember Dusknar being more of like bulky than attacker, so that's pretty good. Uh, let's go ahead and Dark Pulse. I was gonna say, I should, I should still outspeed it, even with that speed drop there. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Chandelure. Um, so my special attack is up, but my... Let's see. We'll keep battling. We'll keep battling. I was going to say, because my special attack is up, but my speed is down. But I think, even with my speed at minus one... Well, see, I don't even know how fast Chandelure is. I always thought it was on the slower side. It goes first and uses Mystical Fire. Okay, I was able to take the Mystical Fire. What did that do? Lowered my special attack. Not bad. Not bad. Alright, now I'm definitely going to switch out. I mean, I feel like I need to, just because now my speed is lower and my special attack is only a plus one now. Poltegeist. I will switch. Yeah, I'll switch. I was thinking, what if I use Parting Shot? But if the Poltegeist outspeeds me and hits me first, then yeah, I don't, I don't know if I want to deal with that. I don't know if you guys can hear, but it's kind of thundering and raining outside. I don't know if the microphone's picking that up or not. Okay, so I can use Crunch, which is super effective. I'm trying to remember what else he has, because I'd, I'd like to be able to heal... Uh, I'd like to be able to heal Night Fox. Maybe I'd do that now. I don't know. If, can Pulte guys... I'm going to heal Night Fox right now. Uh, Yeah, let's do it. All right, he uses protect. So that was a really good, uh, a really good move on my part. We'll use crunch. He uses nasty plot, which raises a special attack. So hopefully this crunch will take it out in one hit. Nice, nice.
Cursula. Yeah, we'll switch. We will switch actually back into Night Fox. Use Dark Pulse. Okay. It flinched. I'm gonna nasty plot. Strength Sap. My attack fell. Huh. That's an interesting move. Uh, that's a very interesting move. Alright. <clears throat> Gengar is next. I will keep the current Pokemon. So, my attack is down, but that's okay, really. Um, well, unless I try to use Sucker Punch on this thing. Here we go. Here we freaking go. Well, no. I won't be using Sucker Punch because I'm going to be Dynamaxed. Okay, I've already Nasty Plotted. I'm going to Dynamax. And I'm going to Max Guard to see what it does. Gengar, Gigantamax, swallow everything in darkness! You know that's how he talks. I think it's creepy. Like, imagine just like seeing that thing like pop out of the road, and you're just like driving your car like straight at it. I hope this max guard works. I had max guard fail on me at some point, like earlier in this let's play. There we go. Cool. Max Ooze. Okay. Max Darkness. It does outspeed me. Okay, but that didn't do much. That's cool. I like it. Now, depending on how much this Max Darkness does, if it doesn't knock it out, I may go for another Max Guard and then. Hey! No worries. No worries. Okay, Feeble, I see you. Freaking Feeble. You never you never expect like those like early like root mons to like do much. I know my hair is weird. But freaking Feeble came through, man. Carl wants to learn explosion. <laughs> no. No thank you. Maybe my mask kept me from seeing just how strong you really are. You got 8640 for winning. That's good, because I just spent a bunch of money on potions. Challenger Patea has done it again! What a performance! She sails right through! Crumbs. That was ace. Oh, I gotta press the button. G give it your best out there. I'm mad about strong trainers. Our seemingly unstoppable challenger is headed for the final round, but who shall... Who, ah. But who will she meet there? Will it be I pass on Dynamaxing Peers or the Dragon Lord himself, Raihan? The next match will decide it, so don't go far from your screens. All right, these are the results of the second round. Raihan beat Milo, of course. Peers beat Kabu. All right, so it's Raihan and Peers versus me. Um, wait, no, Raihan defeated Peers. Yeah, Raihan defeated Peers. Dang, you mabbit. Sis, you shouldn't be forcing your way in here. Oh. Ugh. You look so sloppy out there. Yeah, Raihan is pretty strong. Oh, 
Okay. Well, this is going to be tough. So I'm trying to remember what he usually... I think he starts out usually with a Torkoal, if I'm not mistaken. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start out with Pelipper, actually. I think he's... I'm tr what does he start with? Is it Torkoal? I know he he starts out with something that sets up weather. We'll 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 start with Pelipper. That way, if it does set up weather, then Pelipper can set up weather. All right, I think I saved right. Just in case I didn't, I'm gonna save right now. I cannot remember if I saved. I'm nervous about this one. Have I used Machamp yet? I don't think I've used Machamp yet. This this might be the one where I use Machamp. Here it is, the last match of the finals! Who will learn the right to challenge the unbeatable champion, Leon? Will it be the brilliant rising star challenger, Mateo? Or will it be the only trainer the champion, Leon, calls his rival, the Tamer of Dragons, Raihan? I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry that I'm that I'm talking like that. I'm just, I'm just, yeah. You're really something else, kid. You made it all the way here. I guess that's why the champion himself endorsed you, yeah? Leon's my rival and he chose you. So I've got to pr first prove that I'm better than you if I'm to beat him. I've reworked my whole team and now we're all geared up for one-on-one -on -one battles. You might be thinking you beat me once already, but if you think I'm the same Raihan you faced during the gym challenge, you'll soon regret it. Oh, goodness. Here we freaking go. I don't know, is that what he does? What does he do with his hand? You're challenged by Gym Leader Raihan. Gym, yeah, Gym Leader Raihan. All right, I was right. He does lead off with the Torkoal. So Torkoal's gonna set up the sun. Go on, Scooper. Scooper's like, bah, bah, bah. Torkoal's drought. That's drought. It gets sunlight burning real harsh. Okay, we are going to rain dance. By the way, uh, when I was doing the live stream a couple weeks ago, it was um, whatever your name is these days who determined, the, decided for me, who uh, suggested that I put Rain Dance on Pelipper, and that was a good idea, so thank you for that suggestion. Um, yeah, he always has all kinds of different names. Bernie Sanders something. The N-word police. Whatever you call yourself these days, thank you. All right, well that worked. Gudra is next. Will you switch your Pokemon? I will switch. As a matter of fact, let's see. Is it was this was that was that good that I got Rain set up and now he's sending out Gudra? Doesn't Gudra like the Rain or something like that? Um, I don't have any Fairy type moves, do I? All right, I guess it is time for Tyson. Did I really come into this with not a single Fairy-type move on the team? I mean, I know Cologne was supposed to be like my Fairy-type that was supposed to get me through this battle, but then Cologne just like failed at life. Um, dual Chop. Muddy Water. Uh... Okay, okay, cool. I can take that. I can deal with that. Well, that did nothing. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was gonna say like, why did that do nothing? All right, um, we're gonna do that again. Yeah, we're gonna do that again. And just hope. Okay, yeah, dual chop. Good stuff, good stuff. Is the ring gonna stop at some point? Turtonator. We'll go back to Scooper. Now I know it's dragon and fire. So like water won't be like Super effective. 
but I was going to say it should do pretty decent damage with the rain going. It's going to use Sunny Day. Have you got a plan to counter it? I sure do! <laughs> I sure freaking do! Rain Dance. What are you doing? A shell trap. Okay. Rain Dance. <laughs> Have you got a plan to counter Sunny Day? Dude, you, you, you saw me use Rain Dance with this Pelipper earlier. Why are you being dumb? The shell trap didn't work. Alright, let's use Surf. What does Shell Trap even do? I don't... Does it do anything? I think it has to be hit in order... And I think it sets up the Shell and then it gets hit and then it uses the Shell Trap. Like, I think that's what has to happen. I really don't know. Oh, this battle is going too well. Flygon. We're gonna keep the current Mon, you know? Okay. He's a sandstorm. Does he outspeed Pelipper? Is that what's going on? Pelipper. You brilliant Pokemon, you. Duraludon. Okay. I know... I know what I want to do with this Duraludon. I really want to use Tyson against it, but Tyson's HP is down. Let's see, do I, do I s switch into Tyson and heal it, or do I, le like, well, no, because I, either way, Tyson's going to take an attack. Because if I stick with, so if I stick with someone else, and then switch into Tyson, Tyson's going to take an attack. We're going to, we're going to send in Tyson. Yeah, we're going to send in Tyson. And we're going to go for the max guard. Or should I go for the... No... This is to scout out a move here. See what he tries to use against me. Did he just take a selfie? And the fact that he Dynamax first means that he is faster. Come on, get that max guard up. There we go. G max depletion. Oh, 
Okay. Max potion this time. On Tyson and his 350 something HP. Let's see how much this does. Okay. Not bad. Not bad at all. Okay. Let's do it. Let's, uh, Max Knuckle. He's gonna use Max Knuckle. The G Max depletion should have been stronger. Yeah. Shoot. What did that do? That raised its attack. I need to, I need to watch out for that. But my attack is also raised. I may need to heal. Actually, I am gonna heal. Yeah, I'm gonna heal. Let's see. Yeah. I can use a hyper potion here. Ooh. Okay, the sandstorm subsided. That's good news for me. Okay, so use Dragon Claw. Let's let's do this. Let's fight. Oh man. I'm trying to think. I have Carl who will resist the Dragon Claw, but the the fighting type move will be super effective. Scooper? Night Fox, Indy. I feel like if everyone scoopers the one well Scooper has pretty low HP. Indy has pretty high HP. And we'll be able to hit it with a fire lash. Indy will resist the fighting type move, but the fire will be neutral. Hold on. Let's look at let's look at defenses here. Indy has a one 8 defense and a 110 defense so it's not that far off but his HP is higher his attack is even higher Indy, Indy might be the way to go here 88 speed 71 speed so it's faster than the champ but I don't know if it's faster than the Duraludon I need a plan on it taking two hits now this one has 131 speed. Its defense is 100, so it can probably take a Dragon Claw if it came to it. I could Fake Out and then Psychic or Thunderbolt. No, because Thunderbolt, no, Psychic and Thunderbolt would both be not very effective. Hmm. This thing has really good defense, but if it hits me with the... Well, you know what? If it hits me with the fighting type move, I could probably take it. But... Yeah, this thing has good defense. Or better defense, I should say, than Machamp. Because I'm looking at Machamp's HP, that Dragon Claw did almost half. And if it, if he uses Dragon Claw again, it could knock me out. Like, that's not, cause, all right, so 176, whoops, 176 minus 89. It did 87 damage, which is almost 89. Yeah, I think, I think that's the play here. I think the play is to switch and we're gonna switch into Indy.
I should have used bulk up. Very nice. Very nice. Okay. Now we can go ahead and fire lash. That'll be neutral. See, and if I hadn't switched, it would have hit Tyson with that whatever move that was. Oh man, that's what I get for overthinking. Okay. You know what? I cannot believe I lost Indy. I really can't believe that. That sucks. That really sucks. We're going to heal. Oh. Okay. Man, Indy was like the, the my OG. Yeah, that was just I should have just I should have just potion spam Tyson is what I should have done there. Yeah, that's totally what I should have done. I should have just potion spam Tyson. He would have done, he, he would have hit me, like, he would have come at me with something not very effective, eventually. Oh, freaking flinch. And... Yeah, we'll use some max potion. Hyper potion will work, but I'm just gonna use a max potion, because why not? Well, you know what, I do have that roly Coley, so I'll probably put that in my team to replace, um, Indy. There we go. This should do it. Man. Oh, I should have just potion spammed Tyson. I was... I was this close to getting through all three gym leaders without losing a Pokemon. Man. Indy was real versatile, too. With its moveset. I'm gonna have some decisions to make. Challenger Matea sees his victory. <sighs> My lovely Pokemon and I have become much stronger than we were before, but you just blew right past us, beyond anything I'd imagined. I'm still pretty young myself, but it just goes to show that there's always someone younger coming up, reaching further than you ever dreamed, and you've got your whole future ahead of you. Keep up the momentum. Prove that Leon's not unbeatable. Number 398, Challenger Matea has achieved a dazzling triumph. Number 398. You guys remember why I picked 398? The trainer who was endorsed by Champion will now face the very man who endorsed her. Oh my goodness, this is the result of the final round. So the reason I picked 398 is because that's how many subscribers I had bef uh, until I reached uh, 5,000. And now it is... 274. Right, the big moment's finally here, eh? I just came, I came just to cheer you on, you know? Still, it's not easy picking sides. After all, the showdown between my it's the showdown between my big brother and my rival. Who should I really want to win more? Fly Ace! I hate your freaking score bunny. Yeah, score bunny is definitely the best starter of the three. Right, you reckon I should cheer for Matea too, don't you? Couldn't agree more. After all, we did start this thing out together way back in Potswick. Score bunny is so freaking OP. It hits hard and it hits first. So you better beat Lee, you hear? If anyone can beat the unbeatable champion, it'll be you, mate. Flay Ace! Alright. 
<sighs> okay, so... Um, I'm gonna do this. I know that uh, I need to get Indy out of there, but I just, just because I know what happens or I know what's coming, I'm just gonna go ahead and, and start this little cutscene and at least get this cutscene out of the way before I end the video. That way, the next video we can get started in the action. Oh goodness. The tents still air on the pitch and the exact opposite from the audience, cheering and yelling. They're both fantastic, wouldn't you say? But remember, the audience is also a bit cruel. They want nothing more than to see one of us lose after all. It can fill you with fear knowing that, but I absolutely love pushing past the fear. I love giving everything I've got as a trainer and seeing my team give everything they've got to seize another victory. It's the greatest feeling in the world and I can't get enough of it. I can feel my partners itching with anticipation inside their pokeballs. Can you really? We're going to have a real champion time. I'm the Galler's champion. I'm, I'm the Galler region's champion, Leon. Me and Charizard and all the rest of our team will use all our knowledge and experience to crush you completely. Wait, does Caracol evolve by trading? Wait, hold on. Hey, look at the monitor. What's that? On the big screen. It evolves by trading, doesn't it? Dang, Nabbit, I'm going to have to trade it to evolve it. Maybe I'll go with something else. I don't know if I need a fire type at this point. Lee, Matea. Yeah, I don't think I need a fire type mon, honestly. I might, I might go with something different. That video stream, that was from Hammerlock Stadium, right? What in the world did the chairman do? I might try and get another, I might try and get something that's a little faster. I wonder how fast Orbital is. Orbital's not that fast, is it? I don't know, but everything he was saying yesterday, did he really pull this crazy stunt to solve some problem a thousand years in the future? I've got to go see what's going on. I'm the champion. I have to go. I should have realized what the chairman intended to do before it came to this. I'll take responsibility now for fixing this mess. This is the real champion time. Oh, because I, I, I chose the option to not show the movies. I want to help my brother. I've got to go. You can help. I was like, isn't it supposed to show like the chairman like coming up on the spring on the screen saying, "Oh, the darkest day has started," but no, I I turned off the movies and the settings to make it go faster. Um, what does he mean he's bringing about, and where did we even hear that name? The statue of the hero, hello, duh. I like how both of those options are basically the same thing. Um, oh, we gotta find freaking Sonia. Back in the slippery world. I should have said Sir Chester and see what he said. But I'm trying to move this thing along, so... Head out onto the pitch at Wyndham Stadium if you're ready. Well, I'm ready, but apparently freaking what's-his-face is trying to be all dramatic and such. Oh, hello. Huh? Matea and Hop? Ah, I completely forgot about the championship match. What are you two doing here? Oh, it's mummy. Haven't you heard? Haven't you been watching the news at all? The tournament is off, Sonia. The chairman saw to that and to send the entire region into a state of havoc. Huh? What? What happened while I was researching things in the slumbering wield? Well, for starters, there's a great black storm or something raging over Hammerlock Stadium. What are they calling it? The darkest day? It's thrown everything into disarray. She's got the rhymes. Still, I'm not sure we need to worry too much. The unbeatable champion will be able to take care of everything, won't he? Hold on a tick, ma'am. Did you say the darkest day? The darkest day is the name for the black storm that nearly brought the Gala region to ruin in ancient times. So, what are you here for, Mate? What do you think I'm here for? I'm here to stop the darkest day, fool. To stop the darkest day? You mean you're going to search for the sword and shield Pokemon? Okay, here, take this. You should head to the Slumbering Wield. I'll catch up with you once I'm done looking into something that's been bothering me. Oh, okay, yeah, because you, you have plenty of time to look into things that bother you while we've got this whole Darkest Day fiasco going on. And she gives us Max Revives that we can't use yet. But maybe one day, one of these days, we'll be able to. Bye, honey. Have fun stopping this tragedy. All that matters is that you do what you can. You become a fine Pokemon trainer after all. Ready for this, Matea? I wonder if we're about to head straight into a wall of fog again. Not that it'd bother us now. 
We both got us trying to say about Pokemons. Going into the forest after Wooloo that day. That was the start of everything, wasn't it? A legendary beginning, really. I reckon whatever we're about to see will be pretty legendary itself. Let's hit and add another page to our tale. Alright, so before I add another page to this tale, I'm going to go ahead and save the game right here. And in the next video, we will continue filling in the pages of said tale. Um, yeah, in the next video, we'll we'll do the darkest day thing. I think we should be able to get all that done in one video, but we'll see. Anyway, uh, thank you guys for watching. Leave a like, leave a comment. If you have not already, please subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye.